Now, the Kenyan opposition has stepped up calls to have the devolution cabinet secretary Anwai Guru ejected from office. Opposition leaders insist Waiguru would take responsibility for the alleged wanton pilferage of public funds by people in her ministry and stop passing the buck. Code leader claims that the planning principal secretary Peter Mangiti is a fall guy for the mess in Waiguru's docket. KTN's Samugina reports. <laughs> The opposition brigade led by Code Corps Principal Kalonza Musioka wants the beleaguered devolution cabinet secretary to step down from office. Code piling pressure on the president to crack the whip in the devolution ministry, more specifically on the cabinet secretary. Code leaders claiming Weguru's defense before the Parliamentary Accounts Committee is a setup to make her principal secretary, Peter Mangiti, the fall guy for misappropriation of funds at the devolution ministry. Mimi sioni kama kuna haki. Kusema permanent secretary aondolewe katika devolution ministry na waziri mwenyewe abakie kule. Now there is such a thing as the person holding the highest responsibility. <coughs> na huyo hawezi kuwa PS, huyo ni waziri mwenyewe. Ukasema ule mama aangaliwe, wakasema hii ni siasa, anachukia mama. Sasa walio kuwa na mtetea wa wenyewe ndiyo na muambia rais, mtuwe huyu kama umutoi serikali dazama. Lakini serikali ya kemezama teari. Reluctance to make the cabinet secretary set, uh, step aside or uh, uh, action be taken against her is a demonstration that there are forces behind her who actually support what she's been doing. The devolution CS pleaded ignorance in the wanton wastage and misappropriation of public funds in her ministry. Our guru claimed procurement falls squarely on the doorstep of the principal secretary as he is the ministry's accounting officer. But the opposition wants her out. To me, I'm a member of devolution officer in the year you up. Everywhere you go, it is corruption, corruption, corruption. Mamba ya Eurobond, we were told it was very successful. Sasa tumeona interest rates za bengi simeenda juu. Defending Waiguru, any father will continually damage the trust that Kenyans have in you. With the motion to impeach the devolution secretary gathering momentum, the opposition has warned its MPs who have signed the impeachment motion not to be compromised. The sponsor of the motion, Nandi Hills MP Alfred Keter, announced that the list of MPs backing Waiguru's impeachment motion had clocked 129 MPs. So this passing the back game, this time, wabunge wabunge, tunawaliza musije mukaweka masaini yenu na lafu kumbe kweka sahi, unataka upatue baasha ya laki moja, ndiyo wondue sahi yako. And that even us as Kanu, we are very much afraid. During our time, they mentioned Goldenberg. During Kimbaki's time, they mentioned Anglo Lisi. During there was the, the, the senior Kenyatta, there was Cheb Kube. During you as now, it seems if you don't act fast, it will be Waiguru Dome. The impeachment motion is set to be introduced in Parliament once it resumes its session. This is why Guru and her team are expected back before PSC in two weeks' time for further probe. Samogina KTN News.